everyone welcome back to my channel my name is PJ Ortega and this is the diary of a social climber um, so today we will pamper ourselves yet again and we will go to my favorite nail salon and we'll have our nails done so we'll have the um, famous and um, highly liked nail um, gel polish um, because it's mas matagal, it's mas nakakamura. It's more expensive than the regular manicure, but it will last you longer. So medyo mas nakakatipid tayo doon, di ba? Tsaka nakakasosyal yung gel polish because it's really shiny, it's so durable, and um, it lasts longer than the normal manicure. So we'll go to Top Nails. It's in Southwood's um, area. Here in the south, of course, and then we'll have our um, gel manicure at Top Nail Salon. Um, they also do lashes. They also do eyebrow waxing. They also do body waxing, paraffin, um, um, spa, foot spa, hand spa, so all the works. So, but today we'll have our nails done. All right, so join me. So We'll have our nails done here and top nails. This is where I usually go to for my hand care, my carpet cure. And let's go inside. They're open. Yeah, and so we're already inside Top Nails and they started preparing the things that they will be using. I'm seated here in my Trono. This is my favorite place. And let's look for the best color that we will have to usher in um, Valentine's. So, yeah, they have Orly Gel Fix, Orly Lacquer. They also have Kucho. Um... I think I'm gravitating towards red to usher in Valentine's. Not so. I am. The first step is that they would file um, the nails, the top coat, because makapal talaga yung gel. So what they would do is that they would file it para numipis. Nakakasosyal, mm, pinafile ka agad. And alam mo yun, makilitiin talaga ako. Eh. So yung mga ganyan-ganyan bagay pa lang talaga, kinikilitiin na ako. Pero masarap. So they would do that for all our fingers. So it will be easier for them to remove the gel polish. Kasi talagang sobrang kapal ng nilalagay nila. And I usually do it... Um, three coats. I always have it three coats para makapal talaga and long lasting. So ayan, file lang ng file. Go, file lang ng file. And then the next step is that they would put yung acetone specific to gel nail polish and then they will put foil and they will make baba that. So ayan. So, parang ginagawang relleno or embutido ang ating mga daliri. So, ang ginagawa dyan, niluluto nila using the dedicated and the prescribed um, nail polish remover from France. <laughs> from France. Di pa bongga. So, from France talaga ang ating nail polish remover. Ayan. So, they would do that for all 10 fingers as well. Siyempre, kailangan lahat mabura, di ba? Kailangan lahat matanggal, nakakaloka. So, ayan. At, uh, while waiting, ayan. So, nagmukhang embutido ang ating daliri. Nilagyan niya ng foil at binabad niya sa acetone. Medyo may tingling sensation yung acetone. Only because siguro matapang talaga siya to remove the three layers of gel. I'm um, sorry. <laughs> gel. Gel nail polish. Nakakaloka. <laughs> so there. Um, at is trying to remove it na. Let's see. Mm. Mm, so, di ba, nahihirapan pa si ate. 
meaning hindi pa masyadong babad na babad yung acetone. So, she will do it again. She will cover the nails again with a fresh bulak and a fresh acetone and wrap it again. So, there. So, it's very important na mababad talaga siya because the gel nail polish cannot be removed easily by any normal um, nail polish remover or acetone. And aside from that, if you use the Orly gel brand, you need to use an Orly um, nail polish remover as well. If you use Kucho, you need to use a Kucho nail polish remover because if you would use it, like for example, you had an Orly and then you removed it with a nail polish remover from Kucho, it will not work. So, yan. So, um, what she would do is that she would um, remove the old gel polish using a pusher. Oh, may foil na. May pusher pa. Nakakaloka. Baka matokhang tayo dito. <laughs> Kaloka. So, there. She would do that um, for each nail. <laughs> so, there. Um, iisa-isahin niya yan. Medyo ano to eh, madiin. So, mararamdaman mo talaga na nakukuskus talaga yung kuku mo. But you have to make the is. Kasi nga, we need to have our nails done. We need to have a very clean and well-groomed nails. If you wanna be social, and you want to be a certified social climber, kailangan hindi madumi at dugyuti ng ating mga daliri at ang ating mga kuku. So there, um, that's where we would make babad our fingers right after. So there, um, she's now cleaning our nails. Tahan-tahan mm. lang ata. Ayoko masaktan. Ayoko masugatan. Pagod na pagod na ako masaktan. So please, dahan-dahan lang. Ayan. And this part of the process is quite normal sa mga manicure and pedicure, right? Removing yung mga dead dead skins around the nails, uh, removing the old cuticles. Ayan. So that's what she's doing right now. And again, she would be doing that for all fingers. Hindi pwedeng apat lang, hindi pwedeng lima. Kailangan lahat. Diba? So there. Ayan. More leanness, more fun. So nakakasasyal talaga. And then now she's making corded the nails. Always remember that when you're doing your nails, I always go for the short, but not very short, ha. The just the ano lang, short and square tip. Kasi hindi nakakasasyal pag medyo mahaba. Yung mahabang matutulis, natusok na tusok, ay nakakaloka. It's screaming uh, hooker. <laughs> medyo parang ano tayo dyan, di ba? Yung tamang social lang. Yung square, hindi pudpod, hindi pang grade school na pudpod. Yung medyo may cutting length, but still very social and square tip. Ayan. So, tanggalin niya yung mga dumi-dumi sa loob. <laughs> Maraming dumi. Ano nangyari? No, those are actually dead skin cells. Ayan. So, this is um, the LED uh, light that we will be using. We will be putting our hands inside that. Ayan. So, she's polishing the nails with parang ano siya, primer parang moisturizer so she, she's putting moisturizer dun sa hand kasi naman talaga nakaka-dry yung process ng pagbabad sa acetone nakakaloka yan so ayan she's priming the nails and then this is not a nail polish yet what she's putting is a primer so, diba, for makeup, 
you also use a face primer if you're painting a wall you also use a primer para magandang finish so she's doing the same thing she's putting primer on all of our nails so yeah and then this one is the first coating so ayan she's putting the first coat and you would see she would also go uh, in front of the nails and underneath so she would lock the nail polish so parang nila lock niya di ba nakakasa siya may pag lock na nagaganap para talagang tusok na tusok ang kapit ng ating nail polish parang laban na laban siya na kahit sinong kalmutin mo hindi basta basta matutong ka ba't matutuklap ang ating nail polish so that's what she's doing right now ayan and then she would again do that for all five nails for the left hand and then five nails for the right hand nakakaloka <laughs> so there um after that, we would put our hands inside the lead light para maluto yung first coating and then of course the second hand. So the first coating would always be colorless and then again, she would put on the color of your choice and for this month, I'm choosing the color red which is the color of love for February. So, ayan. So, first coating. Again, you would notice that the first coating of the color, colored nail polish would always be very, very thin. That's how you put a very nice nail color. Um, hindi makapal ka agad. You put it um, thinly first and then that's where you um, make patong to make it kapal or to get the desired color. So she's very, very tedious in doing so. At kung may mga extra, extra kulay sa gilad, talagang tinatanggal niya yan, kinukot-kot niya yan. So first coating, manipis, and then we will bake it again inside the lead light para matuyo kaagad. Again, so they're doing it on our um, right hand naman. So always remember when you're putting um, nail polish, you put a very thin layer first and then you build it from there. Always remember that nail polish are buildable. Layer by layer, you make patong until you reach the desired color. Alright? So that's very important. Mas nakakasosyal tingnan yung yung na-build na color as opposed to isang salpakang makapal. At laging nagbabubbles yung ganun at laging nag-uumbok-umbok. So as you can see, she's locking the color again, making sure that the front and underneath of the, the nails would have color para kapit na kapit ang ating nail color. So that kung may bala kang kalmutin ang iyong kalaban, ang kirida or ang totoong girlfriend <laughs> ay kapit na kapit so we're on our third coating here nakita nyo naman na sobrang red na siya and the last part would always be the colorless again she's locking it with a colorless and then we'll bake it we'll cook it inside the lead light para matuyo ka agad at tumigas kapit na kapit ang ating nail polish laban na laban yung tipong hahamunin ng lahat pak there you go so she's just cleaning it making sure that everything is nice clean and very shashal and very pretty mm. so ayan Ladies and gentlemen, that's my nail. Oh, di ba? Pak! Ready for Valentine's Day. So this is uh, my nails for the month of February. Ushering the love month. Pulang pula. Tusok na tusok. 
again, always remember that a social person, a certified social climber, would always have a clean, well-buffed nails. That's very, very important talaga. So again, this is Top Nails, where I usually um, have my nail um, cleaned and buffed and my gel nail polish. So we're done with our nails. That's my Valentine's Ready Nails. And I hope you enjoy the video. That's how I normally do my nails, my gel polish via top nails. And if you enjoy the video, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next time in the Diary of the Social Climber. Bye!